So you are going to be heading off to college and you are going to be studying the traditional broadcasting and traditional reporting for sports. What do you expect is going to be different? Well, I don't expect that too much will be different because I think I know what I'm getting into. Um, it's not going to be as much about what's different from what I'm doing now because a lot will be different, but I don't think anything's really going to take me by surprise. I think I know what I'm getting into. Um, you're looking at me with this face like, oh yeah, you, you don't know. You have no idea. You have no idea. (laughs) Well, you know what? Like I, I don't know. I'm just excited. I'm going to go in with an open mind, whatever they tell me that I'm the best at, I'm going to ride with. And, um, hopefully it's something that'll make me some money. Um, yeah. Is that like, is it the the bottom line? Is it you do it because of your love for sports or you do it for the money? Nobody writes about sports for the money. You're right. Nobody. You're exactly right. And you cannot, you cannot have a job in sports media unless you love sports. Right. You can do it because you love sports and because you want the money, but you can't do it just because you want the money. Because if you just want the money, you're going to major in business or you're going to major in something that will get you money. Do you know how many people used to ask me, you know, oh, you're a woman doing sports. Do you like sports? It would drive me crazy. It would drive me crazy because this town that we live in, Chicago, would eat you up alive if you didn't like sports and you were covering sports. They would eat you up whether you were a, a woman or a man. So when people would say that to me, it drove me crazy. I absolutely hated when people asked me, well, do you actually like sports? I mean, there's well, so do much. Do you actually like sports? Oh, stop it, Jason. <laughs> Come on.